welcome back to series kids kitchen today we are going to see how to make crispy and yummy suji bullets come on let's see how to make take a quarter cup of suji rava and grind it until it becomes fine powder in this way it should be in a pan add 4 tablespoons of oil and add 1 tablespoon of chili flakes 1 tablespoon of ginger and garlic paste 1 tablespoon of pepper powder now add 2 glasses of water salt as per your taste A pinch of sugar. Now add the soji powder. Keep on mixing to avoid lumps. When it is in the stage, you can switch off the flame and keep it aside. Let it come to the room temperature. Meanwhile, let us see the next step. Take two boiled potatoes and grate them. I have grated the potato like this. Now let us grate paneer. This is half cube of paneer. Now let us grate this. Now let's mix these three by adding cumin powder, garam masala and salt. Add 1 tablespoon of cumin powder. Now 2 tablespoons of garam masala. Salt the taste. Now let us mix them. Now, before we have prepared dried suji rava powder mix, right? Now, let us mix these both. After mixing, I will show you. Now, add 3 tablespoons of corn flour and 2 tablespoons of basin powder. Give it a fine mix. In this way, I have mixed it. If it is very sticky to your hand, you can also add few drops of oil and mix it. Now let us make this as balls by applying some oil to our hands. We have made balls right friends. From these balls we have turned into bullets. I will show you how I made them. Now take a ball and roll it on your hand like this and press like this that's all our bullet is ready these are homemade bread crumbs friends milk bread will be available with you right i have made it into powder and roasted them without adding any oil in this way you can easily make this bread crumbs for any recipe now let us roll this Bullets into our breadcrumbs. Roll it nicely so they will be very crispy after frying. I have coated all of these. Now when oil gets heated let us deep fry all of these. Oil should not be very hot. When it is in medium hot, let us add our bullets into this. When they turn into this color, you can take them out. That's all. Our suji bullets are ready. Did you like this recipe? If yes, give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe our channel. Bye bye. See you all next time with another awesome recipe.